Cheers and welcome my friends, I'm Horat Drak and we are playing City Skylines After Dark together in our city Cyclist Heaven. We've come a long way in our city. We have um, a very successful agricultural industry district over here. We have a new living quarters over here. That is, uh, I think, looking really lovely. Though I say it myself, I think this is a really fun place to live in because you have lots and lots of um, biking areas. There are biking paths everywhere. We have them underground. We have them running between between every block. You can really use your bike to get around here. Go where you want to know. And um, yeah, as you can see, people are really using that. That makes me makes me happy. We have to do some work with the biking path still. I mean, I've taken them to over here so people can go to work in the um, agricultural um, district over here. This, I think, is the only road without a bicycle lane. I think I have bicycle lanes over here. Yeah, these are double lanes with bicycle paths. I might have used these for the industry area. I could still do it just to get the outer thing here a bit faster. I'm not sure if I have to do that. Uh, it's connected over here with a bicycle path. This has not been such a success. This um, train terminal. I wonder if I could look at the statistics of this thing. I would like to... Hmm, because I this was intended as a way for these high density commercial things to get their goods, but it doesn't seem like it's it's really working that way. I'm not sure if I did something wrong, if it's too far away, or if they just don't need that many goods. Hmm, this is a fire station, that's fine. British Lord. Wait, wait, wait. I'm really excited about the journey. Privately funded spacecraft to use Earth for Moon in space. Yeah, I guess this is a pun about Richard Garriott. A shout out to Richard Garriott, Lord British. He's a fan of fan of privately funded space travel. I think he went. Um, but overall, traffic is flowing pretty nicely. We have a connection between our highways here. I might I might do a second one over here, here between the highways, so people can circumvent the city if they want to on the north side instead of having to drive all the way down here and then going over there. I made this bypass over here. The traffic here is now a lot better I think while the traffic on this side is atrocious still all these guys wanting to go down it doesn't really look that good there are no one-way streets with um, bicycle lanes that's why I didn't build with them over here and what I what I wanted to do for quite some time is to district up all of these things over here. So we we have this district. This is sort of the other side of the river. I think including this, including the train station and this this little bit. You can always change it if you want to. Include all that. The Yatta Hate Boulevard has to become a bit bigger to include this. And the Tim Cool Plaza is fine actually, we could enlarge it a bit over there. But that's all that's needed. I'd like to name the different stations. So we're going to give them name. If you want a district named after you, please tell me in the comments and I will make it happen because yeah I can do that 
Um, these are all our stations, I guess. Oh no, here's one that needs to be named specifically. How are we going to name you? You are Briarwood. Briarwood Station, that's fine. Briarwood Station. Coleridge Station. This will be... Yeah, Crest Station is fine. I'll just leave them as um, placeholders for now. Hillside... Hillside Station. And what else do we need? Oh yeah, we need a district for this specific living quarters because I don't think it's yeah I think it's its own thing it's a bit apart from the rest it's even looking distinct I'm really proud of it liking how it looks and how it achieves what I set out to achieve Florence Square yeah, I'm going to to rename this um, square, it's, it's not really a square. This is called Hillside Square. So we might call this, um, Brunin. I hope that is how you pronounce this. Brunin, um, Hills. Oh, that's good. Again, all right, sorry. Brunin. Hills. Like that. And. Oh, yeah, the Hate Boulevard is looking a bit small. We have to change that a bit. Just to. Just to. Put a bit of order in things. We have some money. I think we will have to start a subway soon. What I wanted to do before all that, I mean, I have to think up a solution for this. I wonder if I should just bulldoze all of that. People can come in here. Oh, and they are doing that in a very hazardous way. I wonder if they're just coming in here to change the direction. Where are you going? Porting, porting, going to baconry, turning to facility, returning to facility, working, what are you? Pick up beefcakes. Alright, alright, I guess that's fine. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything I can do. I mean, I could get rid of this four-way by changing the way all these people come in. I mean, if I went in there and um, let's do, let's do. Let's, let's destroy this. And then let's take this from here. Go up one. Come over here. Go down one. Like this. I wonder if this might change things a bit. Now people are coming coming over here and are being funneled into this area. People are turning over here. Why are you what are you doing, buddy? Now they are why are you all turning around? You're returning to facility, returning to facility. Still importing products without making use of this um, station. 
What do these guys do? Might be a good idea. No one is taking a right turn over here. I'm not going to change I'm not going to change the roads we use. The bike lanes stay, they are important. They are needed. And bigger roads often don't solve the problem really. Has that solved anything? No, people are still standing here wanting to go somewhere, I guess. They have all to go to some point or other. I think this is as good as it gets. I can't do a lot more. I mean, what I could do... Is take this thing here. Um, come up from it. This. Will this destroy the building under it? No, it won't. Oh, I want I want it free form. Like that. Yeah, it's looking horrible. Go down. And funnel into here. Wonder if that will change anything. Oh, it's, that really isn't looking that good. I wonder if anyone will take this this bridge. What do you guys want? Where do you guys want to go anywhere? What I can do is just upgrade these roads here. So people can go where they want. I'm thinking. I have a big thing over here going around it. Not sure if that is really a good idea. Doesn't look really good. So what does this? Let's see. Are there people driving on this? Hmm. I think I could get rid of this. Because really, that is not the thing for people. I want them to go on this highway over there. I just, I just destroy this. Like this. Now I've created another problem over here. That was some funky physics with the trailer. Hmm. People are coming in over here. Being funneled into this 
piece of land, and then they are moving over there. I think the only thing I did wrong is allowing people to come in at one specific point instead of giving them a possibility of of leaving at a lot of points. So I might remedy that by coming in here. And for the one point going here and for the other. Go on. Yeah, no, one down. Wonder if I can do something like that. And come down. Like this, perhaps? So I can take the pressure off over there. All these people coming in over here are also a not so good idea. What I might do is destroy this and make something like that to have people come in in this road where there's a lot less traffic. This has just changed the traffic jam from over there to over here. I wonder if I'm missing something. I mean, we have a lot of additional things, but this looks just horrible. I'm hating it. I think I should destroy it. Oh! Seems I destroyed a power line. I wonder if I could build it over here. But there's one, there's one over here. There's actually no need for this. I'll do it anyway. Just to be sure. It doesn't look that bad anymore. I think. There are lots of people coming in over there, but... I mean, what I could do... Let's also make an opening over here. Yeah. I'll make something smaller out of it. Just so it doesn't look that hideous anymore. It's not a good idea, money-wise, to go back and forth like this. This is a good idea. I'll keep that big thing so people can go in both ways. But that's... that's okay, I guess. And this is also a good thing. Yeah, there's less traffic in the night. So we won't actually see what's going on here, really. Uh, some some burning building over there. Yeah, get to it, boys. The real cereal is on fire. So yeah, people coming in over here. I might change the station, Briarwood Station. And put it over here to give them another point to import and export goods. Wonder if that's an insane idea. I mean, Briarwood Station is here, but it doesn't look like it's being used at all. I mean, no one is using this thing. No one. It's mind blowing. What is their problem with the tracks? 
thought I, I really did all the tracks that were needed. This is connected to these tracks. They run over here, they run over there. They're meeting with the normal tracks. They're integrated into this track system. No, there shouldn't be any problem with it. No problem at all. Hmm. And some dead people, oh sorry, some dead people not, not being picked up. Where are we, um, crematorium capacity wise? You know, one third only, so it might be a traffic problem. Might be that they have to go very far. I haven't built any services over here. Let's look at the health capacity, that's also fine, I guess. Water is good. Power is good, garbage is fine, fire hazards are okay, I guess. Police, yeah, we're getting near our jail capacity, but the criminality crime rate is not a problem anywhere, so I'll leave off. Ah, yeah, what I wanted to build, oh, we have 25% highly educated people. Even though we have no university. We have enough high schools. We have enough elementary schools. Could put a elementary school in Brunin Hills. Not sure if I'm going to do that. A university. Where, where should I put that? Um, only young adults can attend the university. Provides education for young adults without the university. They will find jobs instead of getting more education. It's a requirement for buildings to level up. Higher industry requires educated workers. Okay, I could put it down here. And um, yeah, it looks a bit weird, but this is a prime spot. It must be a bit annoying for the people with the with the thing here right beside it. But it actually, I think it's a good idea. I'd like to put it in, in this, into this space over here. Not, not on the side, but into this thingy. Space already occupied because of the curve of the road. So I think we'll, we'll change this road slightly. Take our standard road. Take a free form tool. Take this road away. Like this, and now the university should fit in here, theoretically. What's the problem? Sorry, I'm, I'm going a bit over time, but I want this to be done. So, roads. Let's go. Alright, I do not like square roads, but let's go square now. Can I fit it in now? Yes, I can. So, let's fit it in over here, and let's worry about the road connection after the fact. More 
something like that. It's, it's not the prettiest, but at least our university has some place to go. Now, we have a university at a whopping upkeep cost. But the good thing is people can go there via train. That is a very good thing. Might put in a subway station later. How's the traffic situation over here now? Let's look at it. Yeah, it doesn't seem that bad anymore. It seems like it's got mostly resolved. There's no jam over here. This is sort of okay. Wouldn't be it wouldn't help if I put any more lanes in here because the trucks have to go in here one by one. They come out of there one by one and then they have to get into the traffic over here. I already did my best to help them get out of here. Oh, what I could do, I could actually do to help them move along a little faster. Yes. Oh, that's not good. Can I go one up? So I still just right. Like this. Yeah, it looks like a a theme park, fun park thing. But this should be effective. It will allow guys from here not only to go to the highway, but also to move to the other end of this whole thing. And it might even be worth it to extend it to over here. Let's look at it. Let's take a highway ramp from here. And bring it bring it down here. So that should allow people to go a lot of places just by going on this ramp. It would, I would have liked it if this would, were a little easier, but people are using it, so it. Oh, sorry, so it must be good in a way. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to end the episode here. We did a lot of things. We named, we named some districts. We named some stations. We built a university in there, and we tried to ameliorate and to improve the traffic situation in anti-scam fields. I hope that's fine. If you enjoyed the episode, please give me a like. If you didn't, please tell me why in the comments. And uh, if you want to see more of the series or my other content in the future, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you join me next time. Thanks and bye bye.